Hello guys, I hope you are having a good time. Now, in today's video, I decided to take a road trip along Thika Super Highway to check on the progress of the bus rapid transit, popularly known as BRT. And the reason why I've decided to go back and check on the progress of the BRT, it's simply because one of us came onto my comment section and I'm telling you, oh my God, he decided to write everything that was on his mind he was like pam your video is too shaky you know we cannot be able to see a thing you are all getting the video while in a moving vehicle which is true my friend when I check on my previous video the video actually the guys complaints were true I was all along in a moving vehicle, the video was shaky, and he didn't just stop there. He was like, at least you should have stopped, got on top of the bridge, and take a video while there for us to be able to see exactly what I'm doing. Oh my god, I just remember in a meeting with Miss Trudy and Wodemaya, Wodemaya was like, okay, always check the negative comments positively because those negative comments are the ones that are going to make you grow when somebody writes a negative comment it's because these people want something better and that is why i decided to actually do it to go and check on the latest progress and then do something better and i, I feel i felt so ashamed because at that moment it was some four weeks back what I did, I decided, you know, to delete that comment. And, and, and currently, I'm like, when such comments come in, I'm going to embrace uh, such comments because that the comments that are going to make me do what? Grow. Apart from, you know, just enjoying the positive, the positive comments and all that. You know. The interesting thing about the BRT thing is that passengers will have to board the express buses on footbridges and dedicated terminals via express lane to Nairobi Central Business District in a bid to reduce commuters' travel time and decongest the city. The planned BRT system is finally starting to take shape with remodeling of the car. And for whatever reasons, the stations have been designed in such a way that access and exit from the stations is through the footbridges. That's the only interesting part of the BRT system. And actually, if you have a keen eye on the road, you can actually see a red mark on the road which shows where the BRT buses are going to pass. The points linked to footbridges will then serve as BRT stations erected along islands between the carriageways. Remember, the BRT concept aims to decongest the city and reduce travel time. And also, it is being supervised by the Nairobi Metropolitan Area Transport Authority, popularly known as NMS. 